Hello everyone, welcome to Irfan CFPS YouTube channel. Learn fire protection design by subscribing to my channel. So in today's session, we are going to learn about the sizing and placement of class A fire extinguishers. So we will focus mainly on the location requirements of class A extinguishers as per NFPA 10 requirements. Before we move forward, we need to understand the basic concept of the travel distance. So as you can see on your screen, you have a person running towards the fire extinguishers from a particular point. So the travel distance as per NFPA 10, it is nothing but the actual walking distance from a point to the nearest fire extinguishers fulfilling the hazard requirements. So our location requirement will depend upon the travel distance only. So you need to know the travel distance definition. So I have extracted a table from NFPA 10 and which is referring to the class A hazards. So basically we will discuss about the upper portion later on. But for now, just remember the maximum travel distance to fire extinguisher shall not be more than 75 feet or 22.9 meter for any hazard occupancy. See the definition of the light hazard occupancy, ordinary hazard occupancy and extra hazard occupancy for extinguishers is different than the occupancies which we have defined in sprinkler system. So in this slide, let us try to consider an example to understand or to calculate the number of extinguishers for a particular building based on the maximum floor area concept. So here you can see maximum floor area per extinguisher for light hazard, ordinary hazard and extra hazard occupancy is 11,250 square feet. By using this, we are going to calculate the number of fire extinguishers as per NFPA 10. So basically, if you give me a few minutes, I'll just try to draw a particular building which has like 450 feet length and 150 feet width. So in this particular building, we need to provide the quantity of extinguisher. So basically we are going to calculate the number of extinguishers required in this particular building. So as per the table, the maximum floor area per extinguisher for any hazard will be 11,250 square feet. So our building area we need to calculate. So our building area will be 450 feet multiply by 150 feet which will be equivalent to or which is equal to 67,500 square feet. So now we got the total area for our building. So this total area divided by the maximum floor area per extinguisher for any hazard it is 11,250 so no need to worry about the hazard so total area 67,500 divided by 11,250 so approximately we are going to get about uh, six numbers so in this way, we need to calculate the number of fire extinguishers based on the maximum floor area concept. I will go into more details in next class related to the travel distance requirements and other concepts uh, when we discuss about the sizing and placement of class B extinguishers. I hope you understand the concept. Thanks and don't forget to subscribe to my channel.
and make sure to hit the subscription button to get the notification and updates related to the fire protection systems.